August 2024 has been over, and it's time to talk about the top three viewer-rated bikes from Sugarcane.com August Bike of the Month chart. So there weren't many bikes submitted in August, but the ones that were submitted were some goodies. Starting with bike number three, which was a 2023 Rumblefish CS Pro XL BMX race bike. Now, I don't recall ever hearing about the Rumblefish brand, but it's been around since the early 1990s. This Rumblefish CS right here is a sick 4130 chromoly frame with updated classic features and details like the modern day tubing and geometry. I'm digging the blue color with silver details decals and the blue and polished rims are a nice touch but what really makes this bike stick out are the orange parts it's a wild contrast but it works big shout out and thanks to rumblefish owner richard kerr for submitting this bike right here i really think it's cool when the brand owners submit bikes to bike of the day that means we're official you know what i'm saying richard said he saw that rumblefish back in the 90s he designed the frame and forks and then had them built bmx plus did a test of one of his bikes and put it on the cover calling the Rumblefish Barracuda the most radical BMX bike ever. Richard went on to say that he spent a lot of time at the shop watching his bikes being built. So a couple of years ago, he got a jig and started building frames for himself and his grandkids based on what he learned and remembered from back in those days. This bike is one of one and it's a true old school frame and fork, but with updates. He used modern tubing and geometry, but with that old school style. The frame features a tapered reinforced one inch head tube and a tapered reinforced standard bottom bracket shell. The frame also has a one inch seat tube and a seven eighth seat post, a standard brake bridge for a side pull brake and the classic loop tail design. The final result, it's got that dope mix of new and old, and it also got that bike of the day status. Now that we know about the inspiration for this build, let's check out those parts, son! Yeah! Alright, so the frame is a Rumblefish CS Pro XL loop tail, Rumblefish fork, Kruppi XL stem, GT Pro series handlebars, AME grips, Castle 175mm cranks, which are very rare, a 42 tooth rocket sprocket, Hope F20 pedals, KMC chain, Phil Wood Large Flan Track 32 Hole Hubs, Wyman 2125 Rims, it's got that powder coat trans blue on the center with silver sides, you got the 15 gauge DT stainless spokes, alloy blue nipples, Comp 3 tires, Rumblefish seat post, TNT seat clamp, a old school tangent seat, and Diacomp Nippon brakes. Frame geometry on his bike, top tube is 21 inch, Head tube is 74 degrees, seat tube 74 degrees, and the chain stay length is 14 and a quarter all the way to 15 and a half. That's pretty dope. So let's go to the ratings on this bike right here. And starting with the color, we got a 8.81 for the color, 8.56 for originality, 7.47 for parts, 8.6 for overall style, giving this bike a total rating score of 8.36. Second place, coming in second place is a 2024 JTT True Goose 26 inch BMX bike. Lou Jennings Tempo got this awesome JTT Mongoose inspired custom 26 inch frame built up real nice. He chose the classic chrome plated and red color combo and it looks amazing. And yes, it's a 26 inch frame with 24 inch Skyway Tough Wheels. Converted, you know what I mean? Lou said it's an exact replica of his first bike, which was a hand-me-down. The current bike is a 26 inch custom version of a 1980 Mongoose Super Goose 20 inch. Now that we know about the inspiration for this build, let's check out those parts, son. Yes! Once again, this is a 26 inch Johnny True Torch nickel plated True Goose frame and fork, serial number 50. It has a one inch threaded fork and old school brake setup, 24 inch Skyway Tough wheels. Of course, he can switch back and forth with his 26 inch wheels. He's got a mongoose double clamp stem, Nas Racing Ink Pro Bars, Mongoose Stamp One Piece Cranks, Nas Red 1982 Golden Dragon Snake Belly Tires. He's got a Repro Diacom 1080 Period Correct Pre Bent Brake Levers, Repro Tanch Seat Clamp, Repro Red Fluted Seat Post, Repro Quilted Messenger Seat with Mongoose Seat Badge, Custom Red Anodized Headset and Bottom Bracket, Custom Anodized Chain Tensioners and Axle Nuts, Red and Silver Yaban Chain, Old School Clamp. Clear red brake cable, 
Diacomp brake cable clamps, red MKS BM7 pedals, red ODI mushroom grips. He has a Nas 44 tooth Takaji chain ring with red chain ring bolts. And he says, ride them, don't hide them. So he rides this bike. It's not just a showstopper. It's also a bike that he rides. So that's what's up. Now for the ratings, let's talk about that total color score, which is an 8.57 originality, 8.6. Parts 8.65, overall style 8.86, giving this bike a total rating score of 8.67. This bike also got five ratings from the people, so definitely come back, give this bike a rating for bike of the year. And now for the number one viewer rated bike for the month of August 2024, it is a 2023 Stay Strong V4 XXL disc bmx racing bike this bike was submitted by sean praglowski and he did a great job on the build i like the color combo of the matte green black and gold you really can't go wrong with that it just looks real sexy sean said the matte green frame is almost the same exact color as his first bmx bike the 1997 gt interceptor but he wanted to pop off with some gold because green and gold always look good to him now that we know about the inspiration for this build Let's check out those parts, son. Yeah! So once again, we got a 2023 Stay Strong V4 Triple XL disc only frame. He's got Anta Dagger forks, a 48 millimeter profile push stem, Cane Creek carbon tapered headset, radio helium bars, which are 8.5 inch rise, Troy Lee ODI grips, profile seat, XTR disc brakes, a radio 120 millimeter rotor in the back for that brake action, Stay Strong seat post, Chromag QR clamp, Onyx SSD rear hub, Onyx Helix front hub, titanium spokes, alienation mischief rims, IRC Siren Rise Pro 1.75 in the rear, IRC Siren Rise Pro 1.9 in the front, stands tubeless valves, he's using the orange seal sealant, profile elite cranks, plus 44 BMX threaded chain ring, Onyx stainless SS cog, and a shadow chain. That's right, this bike is laced with some really nice parts. So let's check out the ratings on the number one bike and let's see what it says. It says that the color score on this bike is a 9.18, originality 9.21, parts 9.22, overall style 9.26, giving this bike a total rating score of a 9.22. 10 people came and gave this bike a rating, so he got a lot more ratings than the other guys. And just like every other bike, y'all need to come back to sugarcane.com, give this bike a rating because I want to see what bike is going to be the number one bike for 2024 there's a lot of bikes up already i think we have about 60 bikes maybe a little bit more than 60 bikes right now that are on the bike of the year chart and i'm always looking for more bikes for people to submit so if you have a bmx bike of any size or type if you have a dirt jumper with front suspension if you have a trials bike anything like that definitely submit those bikes to bike of the day it doesn't matter what era doesn't matter if it's a race bike a street bike freestyle bike flatland bike doesn't matter definitely want to see some dope dope bmx and dirt jumpers on bike of the day all right so this is crazy Al Kane trying to play a little catch up with some of this content you know I kind of fell off a little bit for a little while I'm trying to get back on my grind next up I gotta do September's bike of the month results so that should be coming soon and I have some more content coming so keep it locked stay tuned definitely support and that's pretty much it alright so it's crazy Al Kane shitcane.com CACTV and I'm out back to you Billy <laughs>